Do you remember when we installed BlissOS on VMware on my previous tutorial? Well, this time we are going to use the same exact BlissOS version that we have already downloaded, but we are going to install it on VirtualBox. Stick with me and I'll show you step by step how to install it and make it run on VirtualBox. First, make sure that you have VirtualBox installed. If you don't, just go to the Google and then type VirtualBox and then in search result go to the second link which is Oracle VM VirtualBox downloads. And then here, just select which uh, version uh, suits your operating system. In my case, I'm going to download the Windows version. So uh, quickly, we are going now to move to downloading the bliss os version that we did last time already so go to the bliss os website the same thing go to google go to type bliss os and then you will find this official website uh, click download in here and then select the bliss os 16 make sure to select this one and then click uh, this one if you want the, to be supported with google apps otherwise you can select this version as well so where we were uh, installing the version with uh, supporting google services so we selected this one in our previous tutorial so after clicking this you will be redirected to this page and then you just make sure to click on this ISO image, it should be ISO, ISO type. So after finishing the downloading stuff, you have just to install the virtual box on your machine. And then now we are going to create new virtual machine on our virtual box manager. So first thing that create, click on this new, and then we're going to name it BlissOS. And then we have to select the type of the system. Let's make it Linux and then Oracle Linux and then 64. Okay, and then go next. We have to specify the amount of RAM that you need, you want to specify for this virtual machine. Let's give it, for example, four gigabytes and then two CPU. And click next and then for the hard disk you can give it 60 gigabyte and then click next and then go finish and here our virtual machine now is created so we are going to to run this virtual machine and mount our ISO image related to the BlissOS system Click on start and as you can notice the VM is powering up. And here as you can see, he's telling you that the virtual machine failed to boot. Why? Because we are not having any bootable uh, image in the system till now so we just try to go and go to our uh, iso image where it was installed and here is my image and select it and then click mount and try and retry boot it will and then and it's it's booting okay now we are going to go to the installation step to install our uh, system on this virtual machine. So guys here, in order to capture our keyboard, uh, you, you have just to click uh, with your mouse cursor on the, the, inside the virtual machine here. Just tap here and then uh, a box pop up that will inform you that the mouse and the keyboard will be captured and then click capture and then you will notice that our 
cursor have gone so in order to restore our cursor and for example going back to do something with your machine just click on the right control button just one click and then you see you restored your cursor again and then you can click again on inside your virtual uh, machine to capture the the movement inside the virtual machine and then we are going to do the installation click installation okay here the same steps that we already have uh, done in the previous tutorial for the VMware we are going to do the exact same thing here so we are going to uh, click arrow down in order to create a new uh, partition and then of course click no and then we are going to select the label type which is, should be DOS and then new with your keyboard of course make sure that on new and then partition size primary click enter and then we have to go with your left and right left uh, right uh, arrow to go to uh, right partition and then click enter and then are you sure you want to write the partition you have to to type yes and then enter and then enter and then make sure to click on quit enter and then restarting the installer and then our partition was created and then we have to click OK this is the file system should be xt4 the name of we can keep it are you sure you want to format the partition yes waiting until the partition is done checking nodes block Would you like the installer to prepare for auto update? We can just keep no. Uh, we want to install the Globe Loader and yes. And then we will wait until the installation is fully done. Okay, then the installation is done, and then we have just to click reboot and then click OK and then we have to go to go down then VM and other options and then select VBOX VMware no hardware acceleration And our system will be starting up soon. Yes, as you can notice here, maybe the performance of Bliss OS with VirtualBox is much more better. I I have noticed that it, maybe it is much more smoother than running it on the VMware. So our system now is running and we have just to finish up the the setup of our new android machine of course we have to capture our mouse as usual then click start and then there it's getting ready for finishing the setup and for making the device starts correctly and here copy apps and data i think we don't have to copy anything for now just fresh installation just kick don't copy okay here the next step is if you have of course a google account that you want to connect with or not in our case we are not going to set up any google account for now just skip for sure and then skip again as you can notice here that the google service is already enabled on this machine since the system or the the version of the system that we downloaded it's 
uh, it is supporting the Google services. So attack your tablet, not now. Skip anyway. Our machine has started. I want to select launcher three. Google services and the machine is already downloading something, I think, which means that the network is working as well. That's it guys, we have reached the end of this video and if this helped you, don't forget to hit the like button, drop your comment below if you have any question or any uh, problem or any suggestion that you want to tell us about and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more videos.